Hello, Tammy's Travel Tales. Uh, today I'm going to talk about India because I've just gotten back from there and it reminded me of something that happened a few years ago. I've just done three trips back to back and it's been interesting to watch how people cope in different cultures cultures when sometimes things uh, can be frustrating you know and I love India a lot because of the people the vibrancy the contrasts and the lessons that I learned when I'm there and the spirituality and the color and the friendliness and so many things but um, there is an ongoing frustration there too which is that you can't rationalize with people sometimes and uh, so anyway this was brought to the fore for me again while I was watching other people struggle with this uh, notion and it reminded me of when I gave up trying to rationalize with people in India <laughs> there was a point where I realized I was just going to have to let it all go and it came when I was um, staying at the Diggy Palace in Jaipur and I had some laundry done and um, I was going to Morocco after this trip and I would bought two pairs of woolen socks from Kathmandu they were quite expensive and because it was going to be cold when I was in uh, Morocco in the Sahara and it was actually snowing in Morocco so I needed some warm clothes and it was cool in um, India as well but not that cold but it, anyway it was cold enough for me to actually wear these socks uh, once two pairs and then I put them in to be washed because I wanted to take them fresh to Morocco so when I went to collect my laundry uh, the socks were missing from the rest of the laundry so I explained this to the guy that, look, I had two pairs of socks, they're not here. And um, we were actually departing the hotel that morning, so everyone's on the bus waiting for me. And the guy says to me, well, yeah, sorry about that, um, but madam, you still have to pay for the laundering of the socks, even though you don't have them. And I was refusing to pay. I was trying to explain that I don't have the socks. And he was saying, but madam, we did wash them. Even though you don't have them, we wash them and you still have to pay for the laundering of them. So that was really interesting to me. And after we went around a few times of this, I realised I was just going to have to let it go and get on the bus because I was holding everybody up. But I, I, I realised afterwards, I think what had happened was the laundry got sent out and they paid they'd already paid the laundry for the washing of my socks and the fact that I didn't have them was actually irrelevant but it's kind of typical of what can happen when you're traveling in different countries so anyway from that point on I sort of just kind of chose my battles and um yeah and had a lot more relaxed time of it as a result I guess so if it's only going to cost me a couple of dollars I can pretty much just let it go so anyway I'm sure you've had similar things happen I'd love to hear about them uh, so you can pop a little message in the comment section if you like uh, until next time have a great day